Make it back. Make it, make it. Coming out, coming out, coming out. Coming out. Good morning, Nub Nation. What we have this morning is a chilly September Oof, morning. I'm heading up for the Belmar Pro, heading up to North Jersey, and I'm gonna surf a couple heats today in a contest. I haven't surfed in a contest in a while. I signed up, and I think it'll be fun. I'm excited, and the waves are supposed to be pretty good. Small swell, long period, so that could potentially mean closeouts. We'll see, whatever we get, we get, you know? I'm stoked either way. Glad you guys can come on the journey. Let's go. Let's get on the road. Good morning. This is pretty gnarly. Right here. Oh, both, of these, both of these guys buddy. right here. This is heavy. <laughs> All right, I get, just got down to the beach to have the realization that round one is only 15 minute heats. So I'm actually lucky I left as early as I did because my heat's coming right up. I thought I was gonna have like an hour to hang out, but I got to surf in just a little bit here after one heat. So I'm about to get my wetsuit on and get fired up for this because Belmar Pro 2017 is on, boys. Suiting up, got this guy in my heat. We're going body bagging though. Dude, come on. I'm gonna try. All right, I'm handing film duty over to Logan, so expect to see absolutely no footage. <laughs> Wish me luck. Flame is two feet at 18 seconds. All right, But it's for the dream. <laughs> Sick one. Yeah, boy. 
boys. All right, let's say get Zach Humphrey's two cents. Ben just got waved a truck driver to first place. <laughs> Imagine, boy. You literally just drove it to first. <laughs> when I was running out for that heat, I'm bummed I didn't get it on film. Randy Townsend said to me, if I win the heat and stomp a truck driver, he's gonna do a <laughs> for me. <laughs> so we're gonna have to find him and clear this up. What up? Did I make it? Oh, I was helping them. Oh, we were just checking it. Even... I'm about to pay it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I appreciate it. All right, guys, we are down here on the beach at this undisclosed location. There is some gnarly bombs coming through. Nothing even reasonable. So I'm gonna head out on the soft top, try to charge a couple dreams because all that we do is chase dreamers and eat gummy peach rings. Oh, You're pussy. Nah, dude. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Alright, we're out there. Wish me luck. It's gnarly. Alright, here we are. We're down here. It's a lot bigger than we thought it was from there. It'd be nice if someone else was down here to like surf with me. There's absolute dreamers out there. I should have worn a leash. <laughs> dude, dude, seriously, look at that. There's nobody on there. I gotta get in early or I'm gonna die. <laughs> yeah, don't drown. <laughs> we, like, like actually don't drown. <laughs> And my neck was like, and my neck's already hurt. <laughs> Can you even see when the set comes? Yeah. Like, could you see me take it off? Yeah. Dude, I gotta get a big one though, that's the thing. You got a couple big ones, dude. I'm about to get the biggest one ever. Are you? One more and end it. Can I see that? You never say one more, dude. Never say one more.
shit. Oh, you lucky push. You pushy ass motherfucker. Dude, stoked to finally get some solid three foot jersey under our belt. That's so good. <laughs> dude, I love three foot wings. That was dude. seriously the best three footers I've ever seen. Dude, that was three foot. Um, I'm probably not even three, like two to three. Two, one, one to two solid, but three foot set. <laughs> Occasional three. Picture? That's New Jersey. That's crazy. Dude, it felt like big waves out there, like big <laughs> deep water, like Piahi. <laughs> three foot Piahi. On this. On this. Dude, look at this guy, dude. What is up, Milk Nation? What's ben the, Gravy's the man. What's the claim, dude? Where are you going, bro? I don't know, man. <laughs> Got out of work early, came to the Belmore Invitational, so my boy Ben. Yeah. Uh, inspiration. If he could inspire you, if he could inspire me to get off my ass and go surf, he could change the world. I don't know. <laughs> I get to meet the legend. Come on, you know, boys. It was about like an hour drive from Staten Island, so it's a crazy long Do you time live up coming. there? Yeah. Think little getting that low angle. guys I was defeated by a Grom named Alex Brooks I know exactly what I did wrong in that heat and I think if I want to become a better competitive surfer that is the first step definitely a step to take is not getting bummed out about it but learning from the experience in the beginning of the heat Alex took two waves real quick and on his second wave he did a backside turn and I was like okay Alex has a you know a low score maybe a 3.5 a couple minutes went by I got a little bit stressed out I decided to take a small wave I did three nice turns on a wave and then in my head I was like okay I now have the upper hand on Alex I'm, I'm winning the heat now all I have to do is go back out and get another wave as I was paddling back out bomb set comes in Alex is on it Alex gets barreled I went back out waited couldn't find a barrel to match him and I ended up getting second place and getting knocked out of the contest but this is a good learning experience for me and a positive experience in general because first of all I just want to say I'm grateful and blessed in what I can do with my time a lot of people worked in an office nine to five all week long in a job that they don't like and a lot of people worked all day today a lot of people were at work today they didn't even get a chance to go in the ocean I got to come down to the beach hang out with my friends make an awesome video and surf in a contest and drop a nine so like I got to 
to pretty much enjoy myself all day long. And this is, well, like, I, I just feel blessed that I can do this with my time. So I just want to say thank you to you guys for all the support. The Nub Nation has been so amazing to me. I have been really battling with uh, competitive surfing. Like, even this on my way here this morning, I was asking myself why I even signed up because it's, it's tough for me to to get hyped on it because it's you know it's difficult to to lose and just the ups and downs of the sport and everything involved are just crazy after today i actually today kind of sold me on it like i had a lot of fun in my first heat i had a lot of fun in my second heat even though i didn't make the heat i think this is something i'm going to get into more i think i'm going to do as many contests as i can in 2018 i'm, I'm getting a little older so it's kind of now or never if i want to you know do contests so i'm into it now and uh i think i gotta just keep reminding myself that it is fun and i do like doing it i had a great day so we are gonna go try to find some ways before dark and other than that i am stoked thanks guys Ooh! <laughs> 